YouTube! Welcome to the DBT Gamer Show. Let's see what we've got for there, part 15. In the last episode, we explored the coldest place in the entire Resident Evil universe, the Antarctic. In this episode, we hope to find some warmer clothes, preferably a nice big coat. Possibly to be honest, just a jacket would be nice at this point. I mean, look at it. Oh, oh yeah, we, we also have our friends, the um, Venomoths. Oh, Venomo Venomoth. Venomoth didn't fly, did he? It couldn't learn fly, but it, it would show up flying in the battle area. Yeah. yeah. Um, we have two options. We can use the key in this door, or there's also another door we didn't, didn't go through. I'm going to use the key in this door. That okay. way I get rid of a key. Okay, mining room. Uh, it's been a, a while since I've released an episode, but... Basically, your release schedule hinges on me being here. Um, for this let's play, yes. But if I decide to do any other video, like a like a like a solo video, it I can do that on my own. Cause I'm Han Solo. <laughs> yeah, Han Solo, who apparently can't fly for ship. Yeah, but yeah. If you watch game, if you watch film theory, you can't fly for ship because. The, um, that was actually a robot doing all the work for him. Yep. Oh, a, a robot doing fact you with the with the with um, Lando Calrissian. Well, to be honest, I've never actually seen the the movie, so I. It's, can't... A, it's a good movie. No. I I enjoyed it. It's a, I mean, I I do see people's problem with it. Yeah, I do see your problem, but I just sat there and thought, this is not a bad movie. You know, it's it's good. It's not great. Well, anyway. it's good. Either way, I found a hole shaped like an octagon, which basically, basically means the game doesn't have the facilities to actually create a circle. So uh, we're just passing it off as an octagon. Uh, this, this is, um, I think this is in the, in the, in the same era where they, when they decided to, um, in Final Fantasy X, to have a blitz ball, instead of it being a ball, it was a 20-sided dice. This, this, base... this big lumpy thing, wasn't it? it basically, With what? It basically looks like... like um, like, Titus was trying to play Dungeons and Dragons or something. Oh, whatever it was. Okay, where's the, where's the other door you were talking about? Because I have got... That no, way. This way. I have got no freaking clue what I'm doing, where I am, why I'm doing it. That way. This one? Yeah. I'm, I'm just... Oh, bow. There might be... A dog in here. Ooh, oh, a gas mask. A gas mask. At least as if gas leaks occurs. I shall remember that for when uh, Steve fucks up later. Oh goody! Oh sh oh shit! Oh oh bollocks! No! You may want to back off and. Ow ow! Oh, oh Adam, I, I'm being so I'm being sort of eaten by spiders. Bear with me a second. Uh, you may be poisoned as well. Uh, oh no! No, you're not. You know you're not. I don't really have anything powerful to get rid of these, do I? Um, I, th I think the. I would either use the handgun or. Yeah, I'll probably use the handgun and switch to auto fire. I refuse to use auto fire. I think I killed one of them. Uh, no, 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 I didn't. They're, they're still coming. No, this is I why I recommend as the auto fire. Oh, you're pain. Okay, why am I why am I doing this again? Punch, shoot her, him. Do spiders die? How do we know what, what, what? How do we know what gender the spider is? That thing isn't dying. What the hell? You are using a handgun. Well, yeah. What else, what else do you expect me to use? You won't let. Oh, okay. You know, I think I'll just take a mulligan on this and die horribly. No, but you sure. can. You can. You can kill them. I'm not. I refuse to waste explosive balls on a frigging spider. You, ki you kill one. No, I didn't. Well, wait, that, how does that work? I didn't know they could do that. Well, clearly they can, and clearly I'm dying because of it. Hell spray. Do I have? I don't have one. On account of me being dead. Right, viewers. Um, you died, mate. So, uh, so uh, from this, we can deduce that having about two weeks of not playing the game isn't really very good for uh, your coordination. I have a solution to the problem. It's called chocolate. <laughs> I do not care for chocolate. Okay. Chocolate not exactly my favourite thing. Unless you got unless you got some pasta lurking around, no. Pasta? Oh I did have a health spray. Alright. Uh also update on my life, I recently hit 30. I am now the legal age to be 30. 
<laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's the downside of being 30, you don't unlock anything. <laughs> There's nothing else in the in the box, Adam. Yeah, I know. I'm just I'm just praying that there might be something in there. Just... Shall I? You have exploding balls. Use them instead. We need to save the grenade launcher for more um, aggressive enemies. Like what? And be literally eaten by a large spider. There's actually really there's actually bigger spiders in this game. Yeah, you know, they, they make this spider look like um. Were those ones that you find behind your bookshelf? Whereas the biggest spider is like the one from Eight Legged Freaks. Oh. And if it steps on you, you're you're a very dead person. So shouldn't I be using the um, the explosive stuff for them? Well, for the um, giant spider, which there is only one of, uh, you can probably just use the grenade launch on that one. But for the little ones, maybe you want to use the exploding bolt. Anyway, okay. the um, they were in the um bio room. So should we go um, should we go g give them a present? Yeah, an explosive present. I don't. I honestly do not like using explosives on spiders. It seems like a waste. <laughs> well, look, look, these spiders picked a fight with the wrong gal. <laughs> you know, come on. This. There you are. Oh well, freaking done. Really? Okay. So, um... What the fuck is going on? How is this happening? I don't know. I'm, I think I'm actually firing through the floor. What the hell? Hmm. Die? Okay, it's dead. I think. Oh, oh. So that one spider took ten bolts. You know what? Okay, so... That was a waste. To the point where I think, actually thinking, if this is explosive bolt. Oh, never mind. Uh, there's, there's also um, some handgun rounds on the in the giant spider. There's also there. a label on there if you can get a label. I'm gonna grab the label. I mean, if you saw how. I mean, I mean, there, there is a I know it's because run in here, grab all the stuff, and just leave. I'm actually debating that right now. So I just die again, and there's also herbs as well, but. Is that clear? Well, I can't see a thing. I know we need the power on, and we need this is the one of those rooms that. There's something else here. Oh, more bullets. Yeah. Okay. So okay. So I've got the the am. Oh, it's off. I've got. <laughs> okay. Where did that come from? There are two herbs there. Where? Right there. If you just mash. I'm p yeah there yeah. You go. Fair enough. Okay, how the hell do I turn the the power on? Because this is getting just friggin' ludicrous. There's, there's also a new herb. I don't care. I honestly do not care at this point. I'm wasting ammo on things that, frank, frankly... Where's it, where's it gone? I don't know! <laughs> oh, it's hidden behind the tube. It's, it's got stuck behind the tube, so take advantage of that and just, run, and just grab all the shit. It's got stuck. He's stuck. It's unstuck. There's nothing else to see. Herb, uh, right there. I can't see what's being said because of you. What kind of creature are they raising here? Oh, bloody no. Uh, Giant like spiders by the looks of it. Yeah, they're sort of things that if they bite you, you immediately turn to Spider-Man. I don't think Spider-Man's a, a possibility. I think more, more, I think there's more chance of me turning into a corpse. So, is it actually necessary to go in there and collect that stuff? Yeah, you need the barcode. Do I need to turn the power on? The bar, the, the barcode. If you if you turn around, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. if you if you turn around, I'm gonna have to ask you to walk walk me through this. So honestly, uh, uh, no, uh, genuinely no clue what's going uh, and on. And then if you place the um, barcode on this box, later on when we get the power on, we can use it to our advantage. So okay, but the power still isn't on. Yeah, I am well aware of that. So how do I turn the power on? I believe the power room is located up the staircase. You mean upstairs? Yeah. So if you go up the stairs to the mining room... There, I there's think nothing there's, in there. I'm sure there's a door off it where you can go to the power room. I, I just searched this room, there's nothing in there. It is very dark, so you may have to just look very carefully. It, my eyes aren't that bad, surely. The, what the hell? Right, just... Aha. Right. 
There you go. Oh fuck, what? Oh piss off! That was, oh fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, just... Oh, what the hell am I looking what? at now? Oh. One more word. Okay, that's, that's, okay, that's clearly a thing, but not a thing. What the fuck? Oh, oh thanks! <laughs> Great, fuck off! You know, I'm just... T tell me to sit. Just make it sit. I, 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 I can't even see it, let alone s tell you to sit. There, 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 there's also, a switch. Oh, there's can, the switch. I can, I can see something glowing. Naturally, there's a thing between me and it which I couldn't possibly freaking recognise. Lever for the generator. Yes, thank you. The self destruct sequence has been activated. You have ten seconds until you shall die. Have a nice day. So, um... Light's not occurring right yet. Still in darkness. That's good. Okay, I've got the generator on now. Do I have to turn the power on us? Oh, hello. Herbs. Yeah, I'm gonna need them. I think that was a, I think that was actually a blue herb. Oh, piss off! Well, there are poisonous enemies around, so... Uh... Yeah. Well, they performed a trick. Right. They roll. They they rolled over and they died. Good. Uh, is that how? Is that how it works in crafts? Possibly. I don't, <laughs> I don't know anything about crafts. <laughs> I don't often get to make that sort of jokes. I just sort of I thought I'd just crowbar it in there. Sure, why not? You get a crowbar into these dogs' heads while you're at it. Ah, aha! Ah, a, a the, thing. They the, the flip the switch. <laughs> and then you got you got to flip all the things off and oh hello. <laughs> right. So now oh, we're I do a herb. Let's do a herb. Is that so even with the light on, I'm missing shit. Right, oh, right, 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 right. Uh, why don't you combine all three of them into the into the into the herb of legends? Can I combine the blue herb into anything, or is that that just for curing poison? Uh, you can combine a blue herb with a green herb, and then you get a little bit of healing with the um, with the blue herb combined. All right, fair enough. And you can also put, uh, put a red herb onto that, and then you get the, the ultimate healing plus poison. Yeah, cure each. which I very rarely use. I can't. because I just I've just never needed that much healing to be honest, and and poisoning. It, there aren't that many enemies that cause poison in the Resident Evil universe. There's the poisonous hunters, there's the fucking spiders, there's the fucking moths, and there's the um, zombies in Resident Evil Gaiden who can poison you. With all, it's only the female ones because that makes a lot of sense. Uh, make and a, I, make a, a statement on gender politics, though. Only well, women are poisonous. Well, that's what that's how the game operates. I'm not trying to offend anybody. That's literally out of program by Capcom. I, on the other hand, and don't M4. give a rat's out if you're offended by it or anything. If you want to read, if you want to read offensive shit into things that really, let's face it, aren't offensive. Then that's, that's your own stupid fault. Am I forgetting any more poison enemies? Um, all the plants in, in Resident Evil Two. Spiders. I, I said spiders. Did you? Yeah. I wasn't paying that much attention. Okay, so we've finally got power back on, which would have been nice to go through that spider room. Well, do you want to go back in there now and see if there's anything else? Not really. Because there's still a spider in there. Yeah, but now we have power. Uh, Technically, I should have hypothermia at this point. Uh, you're fine! You're the badass known as Claire Redfield. She laughs at cold. She's I'm the wearing a vest, a t-shirt, and exposing my midriff and my arms. That is not good for this kind of environment. Uh, to the right. And if you activate this, the, the switch in front of you... There's no power. Oh, no. The, the but, switch to the left. Sorry, i, I got to activate the other switch before I can activate the proper switch. Right. Now, now when, when when Chris comes down here... You... Should like Chris, you? Yes. You should be able to get the mag... With the magnum. Alright, so that's gone off to the bio weapon room. And how does that help me? If you go to the weapon room, that's where you, that's for, that's for Chris later on. So we're, we're planning ahead. 
So uh, we'll go to the bio, bio room. Yeah, we know. So we're, now we need to go back into the bio room. There'll be one spider, which shouldn't be a, that much of a problem. I can, I can dodge around one spider. Okay. I should have dodged around the other spider, to be perfectly honest, but there we go. Um, I'm going to use all green this time. Yep, someone turned on the... Um, oh, that's why I couldn't go into that corner. There's a freaking cage there. See what see what difference light does. Yeah, it, it makes quite a lot of difference. Anyway, if you just talk to the box, you should be able to get something. Leaking bow gas. Oh, uh-oh. Leaking bow gas. Uh, get, the get the gas mask. Right. Otherwise we're choked to death. I just seem to be perfectly fine. <laughs> Mm. I'll take the he, may, he may want to combine the, the green herb into the three to make it make a triple herb. Mm. I'm going to use it now. No. So apparently, I'm fine. It's anti bow gas. I'm not a bow. Okay, well. So okay, I've got the the anti bow mask face thing. Yeah. So uh, gas uh, mask. That's the word. Yeah, you got the gas mask. So where do I go now? Oh, I have on the yeah, sure. Well, let's go to the weapon room and see if it. I'm going to the weapon room because I think I've killed everything in here. But I'm you, you did kill up in here. I recently watched the um, previous episode to um, just check where we were in the game. Wow. Ooh. Oh, here something's on fire now. Uh, okay. This is Chris Redfield domain. We need the fire extinguisher. Yeah, because only he can refuel the fire extinguisher. So, I. I say we head back to the save room, offload all our shit that we don't need, and then explore the save room, because I remember there being something in the save room that that was trapped. Only, oh, the, we've already seen the rat. Yes, but there is something else that is trapped in the save room. So, uh, a horror of the Ashford family, a, a very, a very well kept dark, dark yeah. secret. So just check, checking corners. No, been, no, no, no. It has been it has been so freaking long since I've played this game. I honestly, I've I've lost the plot completely. On the plus side, I can now see the moths. Not the cute. Here we see the moths in their beautiful, majestic form in their natural environment. Which natural environment. <laughs> natural environment. <laughs> Oh, you're yeah. laying eggs in me! <laughs> it's just a natural environment. In the the moth sits on the on its on its prey and and slowly impregnates the whatever it the, is the, anything. The the the, the um the, the vessel. The vessel is unaware. Tough. Once it is impregnated, the moth will fly away. I will push the switch. The switch has been pushed. Okay, there's a thing. It's a dude. Yep. That is the dude, alright. Pinned to the wall with an axe. Okay, so that's where the Ashford family keep their gimps. Yep, that is the creepy sex dungeon. You hope it's sex. <laughs> that's, that's the thing, you look at something like this and think, I, I hope this is just for sex. Ooh, a pot. Now, is there? Now, can we examine that? Because if I remember correctly, if you examine that, you get something out of it. Stop it. Pot. Check the pot. Ah, there we are. What do we get? Key. Machine room. Okay. All right. Well, best what? ticket with us. What's that say on it? Radio keys. Or paranoid keys. I don't know. It's a paranoid key. I found a paranoid key. Fair enough. That means nothing. Can you do something with the computer? Ah! Look at that! You, like I said, you see what difference it makes when you have lights. Hmm. Well, come on, pick it up then. I don't care about the thing on the wall. The thing, item in front. Health thing, come on! What about the um, computer to your... That should be on the desk. That's about yeah. Can we, can, we, can we log on? I can't even get near it. Oh, well. It's probably dialed up anyway. <laughs> yeah, to be honest, yeah, pro it probably is. You know, that, we, we don't need to deal with that out-of-date shit right now. Yeah, for the, for the, for the kids watching, dial-up was a thing. You had, <laughs> you, had, you had to plug a big box into the side of your computer. Activate, activate the 
uh, the in- Internet Explorer and the thing and sit there and scream at you for 15 minutes. That was how you, you looked. No, 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 no. Go, go upstairs. Go, there's, there's some more. Yeah, that's... that's oh, you've been impregnated. Good. Stop doing that. And now I'm poisoned. Alright, there's, her- there's an infinite poison there. If you just turn around and just grab the poison there and get up the stairs back around the opposite way. Also, there's a maggot on your back, even now, so just, just get off! Oh, leave me alone! Are you poisoned again? I don't. I have no idea. No, I'm not. Okay, okay you know what? Okay, I'm, ju- I'm just, I'm just injured be- you, because you just because bru- I breathe in a purple <laughs> gas. You, you just brutally murdered a child. You just went. Good. <laughs> Good. I need something to cheer myself up after this. All right. That's, uh, the, that's the thing. I came here to be cheered up today. I am the master of being happy. I am the master of happy, guys. Why are you playing it, then? Because <laughs> you are doing the boobies part of the game, because you like boobies. <sighs> also, I like... No, I can't argue with that, but I just don't like the way you said it. <laughs> okay, you are doing the titties part of the game, because you like titties. That's just exactly the same thing, just with more slang. Oh. <laughs> okay, you are doing the more feminine part of the game. I can work with that. Okay, it appears that there's nothing in here. So, should we head to some other rooms? Yeah, I suppose. I, I know that there is a room with a... F- that, yeah, that, there's a room that we can find. There's a, there's a room somewhere, guys. <laughs> we're getting epiphany right now. Epiphany? Epiphany. Okay. Yeah, for those, those of you who um, like don't know. I have my own channel. I, uh, I make videos and last night I did like an hour and a half recording session for Dark Souls and uh, realized that oh yeah my Audacity program the one I used to record my voice just decided to sort of not record anything for the best part of an hour and a half. That's why I often split my videos up yeah, I'm gonna have to. St- I'm gonna have to start doing that. Instead of recording like one big long chunk, I actually like time myself and do like twenty minutes here, yeah. twenty minutes there. Yeah. yeah, that's that's one of the reasons why I do it this way. Because because I'm an experienced YouTuber, I know exactly what I'm doing. Ah, oh, God! Uh, <laughs> where did you go ahead? Where? About seven miles away from here. That should be our target. Great news! And take a look at that. It's a digging vehicle. If we break the wall with it, we might I- have a chance. Okay. Where'd you come from? How did you recognize that? What is going on? <laughs> All I did was examine the block. I know, random stuff is happening. I didn't know, I didn't know, I, I, I tried to examine the table. Uh oh. No, no, don't, 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 don't just randomly play with things, you stupid shit. Don't just randomly give it to Steve of all people. I mean, Alfred Ash would be a, would be a better choice right now. Oh, God. And this is where Steve loses all sense of credibility and just becomes like the worst character in the history of video gaming in general. Oh, what about him? Um, what about um, Ashley from Resident Evil 4? Leon! Help! I'll stick with Ashley if I, don't, if I get to get rid of Steve because, because this idiot is too busy perving on the only female he's ever seen. It's like... That, that's it, it's just operating heavy machinery and just kills everyone. Sure. Why? Why would you leave him here? Why did you bring him along? Well done. You've doomed yourself. We're doomed. I hope that's. Doomed. Sh- doomed. Damn right it's your fault. I hope that's shame. Listen to me. Yeah, you know, he let him say that, it's right. Together. We'd escape a lot quicker if he wasn't thinking with his dick! Come on. We've got to shut off the gas. If we split up, we'll have a better chance of stopping it. Well, I've got a gas mask. I can go in there anyway. I can drag him along and he'll die. That way, I've got one less thing to worry about. Don't forget. We'll get out of here. Together. Also, I love you. (laughs) No, I hate you! Like you are, like right here and right now, he is literally the only reason why we're having to prolong the game. All right, go in there, use your gas mask, and and search the room because we didn't get a chance to do that because Bugger looked over here, decided to destroy the world. 
Also, for the love of God, do not like a match. That's a giant mushroom cloud the size of New York. So I can, I've just got to pray that I can find something worthwhile now. Uh, that's the thing, I came over here, I was trying to examine something on the table, and all of a sudden just Steve popped out my ass. <laughs> well, a wild Steve appeared. When a, when a mummy Claire and a daddy Claire love each other very much, apparently Steve comes out of them. Makes perfect sense, people. Anyway. Oh! Oh, now I need to now we need to find the room with the 3D printer and, and modify this light there. And then we can turn the gas off. Oh shit, I forgot about all that. Because it's got a square yeah. thing, hasn't it? Yeah, it has got a square thing. So if you head... The, I'll direct you to the, um, to the appropriate room in a moment once you've finished... Um, Admiring it. Yeah. Stop, stop it, 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 stop it. Okay, I've forgotten where that room is, but. I know where it is. You know what? Phil Poison. Sure, why not? Because fucking Steve Libido tits over here that can't just operate heavy machinery, surprisingly. Oh, he, 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 um, he got us here without killing us to Antarctica in a plane. Actually, you know, that was autopilot. So Yeah, it was autopilot that got us here. But he did manage to get the plane to take off, and he got it into the air. So he's not completely worthless. Yes, uh, he is. So if you go around this way, past the big double doors, into the other room, there should be a, 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 a heavy piece of heavy machinery which you can use to modify the square into an octagon. Hopefully. No, th this is definitely correct. Also, this guy, he's still trapped. Let me out. Let me out. I just want to eat you. Please. Oh, the sea! The thing's in here I didn't even see because it's too freaking dark. Alright, if you just place the... the, the... There you go. Okay, that's... And then it. press the blue button. Probably should have been determined first. Octagon. <laughs> Put a diamond cutting edge. Process so it goes easily. Um. Oh, don't tell me you have to walk up to the thing and check the thing do I, first. Do I really have to go all the way back? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, that is just needless bollocks. I have already seen that. Yeah, but you... I already know I need an octagon. Yeah, but you saw it and then you died. So technically, Claire doesn't remember it because she died. Really? Yeah. Oh fucking! <laughs> and th that is my canon. I'm going here. This is this is kind of like where you play destroy all humans. This is a completely different Claire. Because she died. Because the previous Claire died. Therefore, the, the, this Claire does not have the exact same memories. I'm not working on cryptosporidium logic here, though. <laughs> well, that's the best thing I can, I can come up with right now. Even after all the all the um of a trauma from crapping out a Steve out of her ass has made her go senile. I'm gonna kiss a moth. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, something I'd rather something I'd rather have sex with than Steve. Then I'm off. Then I'm off. Oh. Because yes, that you might be poisoned again now. Why do I keep doing that? No, you're not poisoned. Okay. What are you doing? Cancel, cancel, cancel. All right. If you... There we go. Ooh, sounds. I'll reply to that later. On that note, we're at 28, so I'm gonna... Well, let's just get... let's just... Let's just get the octagon in our memories, and then we shall head... Then next episode, we shall get the octagon thing, and then he head back here, and then hopefully we'll have, we'll have, we shall have set up. Is there actually any way to get rid of this? The what? Oh, the, the thing on my back. Um, you have to, um... Let it crawl up your shoulder, and then just... Just throw it and smash it on the floor into a pile of... Blood. So really, I've got no. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. Like, so really, I've got no choice but to take damage because of this. Yes. Even though I can plainly see it as a threat, um, and I have no, absolutely no way of defending against it. Well, so you just just talk to the thing, and then we'll cut it apart. Octagon shaped hole. So now try and use the um the thing on it. Yeah. Just just even, to rule out all. Even though I know. What? Yeah, the the, 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 the thing po the the maggots can poison you. Oh, for fuck's sake! This is why I don't play these games anymore. 
No, okay. you use it right. Anyway, now. YouTube, in the next exciting episode, we shall unpoison ourselves. Just stop for a moment, please. So, yeah, see you guys then. Bye bye.